Hey guys, Objector here, and welcome to another Black Ops 3 weapons review. Today we're going to be looking at the Weevil SMG. If you like the PDW in Black Ops 2, you should like this weapon as it's very similar, and like the PDW from Black Ops 2, is based off of the real life P90, which is a weapon I've always enjoyed. I like the look of it, and I love that it has 50 round magazine, and I generally like guns based off of this platform in video games. So let's see how the Weevil stacks up. First, let's take a look at the damage profile. The Weevil will do 30 damage up close before dropping off to 29, 23, and eventually 19 damage. This means it will take between 4 and 6 shots to kill. I'm not entirely sure why the devs wanted to have a drop from 30 to 29 in there instead of keeping it at a flat 30, as it doesn't make any difference as far as I can tell. It's either going to be 120 or 116 damage after 4 shots, which are both more than enough to kill, and with the headshot mu multiplier of 1.1 times, the 30 damage becomes 33, which is still a 4 shot kill. So speaking of 4 shot kills, your maximum 4 shot kill range is 19 meters, and it looks like this. So that's your maximum 4 shot kill range, which is very good for an SMG, and you're going to find that a lot of your kills fall within that range. And the 5 shot kill range is 25 meters, which is the same as the CUDA, the VMP, and most of the other SMGs. If you want to see exactly how far that is, check out one of my previous videos on the CUDA or the VMP and you can exa see exactly what that looks like. So most of your kills are going to be either 4 or five, 5 shots to kill and most of the time you won't be getting into that 6 shot kill range. And as I mentioned before, the headshot multiplayer is 1.1 times. What this means is that a headshot will reduce those 5 and 6 shots kills by 1 shot. So outside of 19 meters, they are useful and the Weevil is a weapon that I find that I do tend to go for those longer range headshots. Just because I know I have 50 rounds to burn through before I need to reload. So if I miss a few shots, it's not a huge deal like it is with the 30 round SMGs. The rate of fire on the Weevil is 720 rounds per minute, which is a little on the slower side of things for the SMGs, especially in Black Ops 3, but it is the same as the PDW from Black Ops 2, and it still isn't terrible, it just isn't anything special and nothing that you're going to write home about. And my favorite thing about the Weevil, or any P90 based platform for that matter, the thing that really makes it stand out is that 50 round magazine. The magazine capacity is really what makes this weapon unique and is going to be the reason you want to use it. I'm not sure why I like having a 50 round magazine since I have a habit of reloading almost after every kill and I find my I have to remind myself that I don't need to reload yet with the Weevil but I find that I do get more double kills with it than with any other SMG just because I'm not afraid to keep firing and I don't feel the need to duck behind cover to reload it if I got, get caught in a 1v2 situation. It makes it very easy to spray while wall running as well. Now as far as what I think of the iron sights on the Weevil, I think they are very usable, especially within those, that first 25 meters. The bright green iron sights aren't too obstructive and I don't feel the need for optics if I'm using it for those 4 to 5 shot kill ranges. But the optics isn't a bad option um, if you like them. It definitely wouldn't be a wasted slot, so pick them up if you prefer them over the iron sights. But personally I find that I don't need them too bad. Next up is the accuracy of the weapon, so we're going to cut to a quick wall test with and without the foregrip. So as you can see, the recoil on the Weevil is fairly predictable as is mostly vertical, not a lot of side to side recoil on it. And the foregrip here is go isn't going to change it a whole lot guys. It's going to maybe slow down how fast it climbs up, but the overall distance that the Weevil climbs with or without the foregrip is about the same. And overall, I don't think it needs it. it as long as you just drag down, it's going to be a fair, pretty accurate weapon for you, and I would say the foregrip is probably a waste of your pick 10 spots, and not something that I would go for overall with the Weevil. Next we're going to take a look at the handling traits of the Weevil. This is by far the weakest point of the Weevil, and where it really falls behind the other SMGs, but this helps balance it out with that 50 round magazines to make sure that it's not OP. So the hip fire cone is average for SMGs, so it's nice and tight, and it's, but it's just nothing special like the VMP was. The aim down sights time is 225 milliseconds, which is slow for SMGs. The average it being 200 milliseconds, with the VMP being a 183 milliseconds. This makes the quick draw grip a very good choice for the Weevil to help compensate for that. And I like quick draw on all my weapons, but I would strongly, strongly recommend it for the Weevil. And this game had a lot of campers for some reason, but don't worry, I go right back and take care of them. 
now that the numbers are out of the way on the Weevil, uh, what do I think about the Weevil and what attachments would I recommend for it? Maybe it's just because it's the I like the P90 platform, or maybe it's because I like the, having the, that 50 rounds and reloading isn't a problem for me. But I like the Weevil a lot. It has its weaknesses with slower handling speeds and an average time to kill, but the magazine capacity counterbalances it nicely. The recoil is manageable, and I don't have too much trouble with it. It's a very good gun to spray with because you have those extra rounds to spare. And overall, the Weevil is a very average SMG. It's time to kill is in the middle of the pack. It's average, it's nothing special. And that's kind of the key to the Weevil. It's a nothing special weapon, except for that 50 round magazine. So if you feel like you can get by with just an average SMG and not having one of the super fast time to kills like the Vesper or a longer range SMG like the CUDA, then the Weevil is going to be a great weapon for you to use. And I feel that if you have the skill to compensate for those lack of um, any standout traits and prefer the 50 rounds, then this is going to be the weapon of choice for you. As far as what attachments I would recommend, I would definitely use the Quick Draw Grip. It makes the aim down sights time competitive with the other weapons in class and takes away probably what I consider the biggest weakness of the Weevil. And as far as other attachments go, I didn't find anything else was really needed and chose to use my points for perks or tacticals. But I will say that Rapid Fire is also a very good pick if you want to decrease your time to kill with this weapon and it, it definitely helps with that slower rate of fire. So that's all for this episode guys. If you didn't see my previous episode on the VMP, click the link on the screen now. If you like the video and want to see my future weapon reviews, don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. Until next time, this is Objector, signing off.